hi guys welcome back to my channel it's been quite some time since I last upload and as you all can tell we are already in July and I have not uploaded any summer videos which is super sad for me I did have a semi accident which is somewhat canceling my summer plans as of right now but I for sure wanted to upload you guys my summer bucket list for 2024 even though some of these won't be happening until I heal and start to walk just because a lot of these activities do need both legs and I am currently struggling in walking. I know the first day of summer was June 20th, 2024 and the last day of summer it is September 22nd which is still a long way so the possibilities of me getting better by then and completing some of my summer bucket list items are very high chance so i'm super excited for that the first thing on my list is to go to a water park you could never go wrong by going to a water park i know many places have them and they're just so fun and nice being in the water all day having fun being on rides just enjoying the water going to the beach I enjoy going to the beach a lot if you guys know me if I could I would be in the beach 24 7 and I just love going to the beach seeing the sunrise and sunset watch a thunderstorm build a Lego set I have never built a Lego set and whenever I have the chance to build a Lego set you guys will be there for me because I will be recording so I'm hoping to do that this summer have a photo shoot i would love to have a summer photo shoot just because i really never have photo shoots in my life so i would love to do a summer photo shoot horse riding at the beach i know a lot of places this is possible so i would love to go to a beach where i could do horse riding save up for tay tay tickets i unfortunately having gone to the era store as you all might know and i would love to save up for her eras tour tickets in october she'll be coming back to the u.s which i am so excited for but her tickets are looking up to two thousand dollars each and it's basically me and my boyfriend since i won't be going alone in this situation so i am hoping to get tickets by then if not it's okay i at least got to watch it in theaters and hopefully the rest of the eras tour is wonderful i know it ends in december which is super sad but hopefully we get to see her on tour sooner read three books i do have a little shelf where i have books i have not started reading any which i should start reading some soon but i at least want to read three books this summer watch 10 new summer movies in theaters which is super exciting i have watched two already i'm hoping to check off this from my bucket list because there is a lot of movies i want to go see in theaters buy concert tickets there is gonna be a lot of concerts starting september that i've been wanting to go but where i live there really isn't a lot of people that come and visit that i want to go see so i would love to travel and see them going to a summer concert which i know is not possible since i am hurt and i have to be going to the doctors every week so it's going to be a little struggle for me to complete this one go to the zoo which i would love to go to the zoo i haven't been to the zoo f quite some time now and i would love to go to the zoo Go to a drive-in movie, never have, and hopefully I will do it this summer. A color run. I would need my both legs to be able to run, so that's going to be a question right now. A beach run, same thing as the color run. Go bowling. I would love to go bowling, but it's still questionable. Zip lining questionable once again. I would love to go zip lining because I've never done it. I feel like I would enjoy it a lot camping it's been some time since i last went camping so i'm really hoping i get to do camping this summer an amusement park a summer movie marathon i don't want to do it by myself but i would love to do a summer movie marathon i would love to do a garage sale it's an easy way to make money and to sell stuff that you don't need or want a road trip i would love to have a road trip during the summer but we are questioning that as well Finish a TV show which has been checked off because I have finished a TV show and anyone that's asking what TV show, I finished Supergirl which is super exciting because I finally got to finish all the seasons and 
as of right now i did start on a new show i'm almost done with it just need two more seasons which is insane which i'm completing a season every day so i'm super excited scrapbooking i would love to make a scrapbook for the summer of 2024 even though my plants are being backed up at the moment but i would love to have a summer scrapbook make clay art i know a lot of people have been making clay art during the summer and i would love to hop in the trend watch a new tv show which i have checked off since i did start a new tv show last week candle painting i would love to try to do candle painting i am not perfect in painting at all dye my hair if anybody knows me i love dyeing my hair i dyed it last year purple and that was my first time ever doing it which was super exciting as of right now this is how my hair is looking which is not that great i did let it grow out because i want to start with fresh new hair when i dye my hair so this is gonna be grown out for a little bit longer and then we're gonna chop it and dye my hair try a new ice cream shop i really enjoy ice cream and i know there's a bunch of ice cream shops that just open where i live so i'm super excited to go and try them watch fireworks which fourth of july already passed so i did watch fireworks diamond painting i enjoy doing diamond paintings as you all could tell by this wall if you guys watch my tiktoks but i did start in one so i'm hoping to finish it soon trampoline park it's questionable because i do need both of my legs for that I would love to tie-dye a white hoodie just because I've never tie-dyed hoodies before. I did do shirts, but I haven't done a hoodie. Painting flat rocks. I've done it before, so I would love to do it again. Flower field. Where I live, there really isn't a lot of flower fields that you could just stop and take pictures, but I would love to hunt for one and just take pictures there. Go to a museum. I enjoy going to the museums in different cities and I just feel like a museum is a great way to learn even during the summer. Farmer's market. I enjoy going to the farmer's market, just waking up early and enjoy going. Exploring new cities slash towns. I would really love to do that right now, but it's going to take a pause for me to do that since it does take up so much energy for me to walk painting old vinyls i know a place here in my town where they sell old vinyls and i would really love to go buy them they're super cheap two three dollars and just paint some and put them up in my wall as decorations bake cookies i enjoy baking if you all don't know i enjoy baking so i would love to bake cookies this summer watch the summer i turned pretty i love the show I hate the fact that the new season's gonna come out until 2025, which sucks, but I would love to rewatch it. Go paddle boarding. I do need a lot of energy for that, so that's gonna be questionable. I have a bonfire at the beach or at the house. I've really never had one. I've done one with some of my friends with s'mores, but just the bonfire by itself, I've really never done it before hopefully you guys found some ideas that you guys might want to do during the summer my summer bucket list will just be growing and i'll be adding stuff to it but hopefully you guys enjoy the video don't forget to like and subscribe and hopefully i see you guys soon with another video bye guys